Today is the first full day of summer. It is also the time of the year where you have the highest chance of getting a sunburn, which could result in skin cancer. Ken's Five reporter Jeremy Baker has tonight's Wear the Gown. Most of us know the fairer the skin, the more likely you could get a sunburn. But when it comes to African Americans, protecting skin from sun damage is still extremely important. It is important. Um, you know, that we break this, this misconception that, you know, African Americans or people of color, you know, shouldn't be wearing sunscreen daily. Dr. Milton Moore with Sonterra Dermatology says he tells his black patients they should get skin checks just as regularly as those with pale skin, especially when it comes to the deadly melanoma. Which is very rare in the African American population. It actually accounts for only 2% of cancer in blacks altogether. They still can get melanoma, but actually, black patients get melanoma in places that are, are not so much sun exposed. Dr. Moore says African Americans are also diagnosed more often in late stages of skin cancer compared to Caucasians. 52% of patients diagnosed with melanoma in advanced stages are black patients, compared with just 16% being white patients. There's this misconception that the risk of skin cancer you know, is negligible. It really does hinder the black population. Dr. Moore says another issue facing African Americans is the disparity in the black population and lack of access to care and African American dermatologists. Some people may feel like they want to see somebody who looks you know, similar to them and who understands their skin. And then also without the professional you know, learning you know, in residency and training, depending on where you go to school, you may not see any black patients. So things get misdiagnosed. Dr. Moore also says using a daily moisturizing sunscreen plays a huge role in those with acne in preventing post-inflammatory pigmentation, which is a thermal burn caused by the sun, and to also check the bottoms of your feet for changes to your skin. Jeremy Baker, Kent's 5. And for more health stories, head to wearthegown.com.